Good day everyone. My name is Ola Yuola Ola Yinka. I'm here to teach you mathematics and our topic for today is area of plane figures. Before we proceed, here is our behavioral objective. At the end of the lesson, students should be able to recall, use and apply the formulae for the area of plane figures. Students should be able to calculate the area of basic shapes. Now, introduction. The area of shapes is a mention of the surface. The square is used as the shape for the basic unit area. A, a square of one meter covers an area of one square meter. A square of one centimeter covers an area of one square centimeter. As you can see it on the diagram. The formula for the area of basic shapes are rectangle. Area of rectangle is length length times breadth. Area of parallelogram is breadth times height the area of triangle is height times base or breadth area of circle is pi half square pi half square now the representation of alphabet on each on each formulas now L represents the length of a figure. B represents the breadth or the base of a figure. H represents the height of a figure. I R represents the radius of a circle. Now, area of of a trapezium. In the diagram, A B C D is a trapezium with line A B and line dc can be can be a and b respectively let the perpendicular be distance b apart b h join ac ac let the length of a b and dc be a and b respectively let the perpendicular distance be apart b h Example, find the area of trapezium in the diagram below. In the diagram, we have line SP and line RQ. Area of PQR is equal to half of bracket open, open bracket plus 11 close bracket times. 7 meters square. We have 5 plus 11 equal to 16 and we have half of 16 times 7 equal to 16 times 7 meters square and the product of 8 times 7 equal to 56 meter square. Now here is our summary. Area is a measure of surface covered by a plane or by a curved surface formula the formula is an equation that, sh that shows relationship between quantities trapezium a quadrilateral with one pair of parallel sides a quadrilateral with one pair of parallel sides now our assignment if the area of transmission in the diagram below is 14 and a half 
centimeter square find the value of x now we can send our assignment and if you want to also if you want to make an inquiry you can make an inquiry or comment through gmansmith at edifors.ng please and please let's and subscribe to our channel thank you god bless you